Hi there! In this video I will show to you how to add a simple text box to a product page in Shopify. I just want to keep it really simple. So beside the simple text box we have also different kind of other product options opportunities. But let's now just focus on the simple text box. So this is my bracelet and I want that my customers can enter a text like Liam and Sarah. So in my case now what I have to do is to open up our Textify app for Shopify, click the button create field and now you will see you have two opportunities. You can whether decide to have more advanced product options but we can keep it simple by just clicking simple text box. I will do so and now on the right side you can already see how the text box will look like. So let us now name it uniquely text field 2 for example, whatever the name we desire we can just enter it here and then we can move on with the text field settings. So the text field settings are very impressive. I can style the text box according to my own wishes and imagination. So what I now can do is I can just say I just want to have a single line text field. It should not be resizable because it's good like it is. I can now define my heading here. Please enter a name, double point. Now I can also change the placeholder, for example, Liam and Sarah. I can move on. I have no opportunity to decide what kind of font size we want to have. I can also decide if it should have rounded corners or if it's good like it is. I can now decide also what kind of input I want to allow. Text and numbers, only text, only numbers, just an email address. I can also decide which size it should have, full width or out of width, then it will adjust accordingly. I can now also change the label color. So for example, let's say my UI color is for example this one. So I can just also copy the hex code. I can say also border color should be in my company UI color. I can also say the text which will be entered will become blue. So placeholder is good that it is in light gray. I can also decide if there is a tooltip which color it should get also blue. And now I have also some more interesting yeah, opportunities. I can decide what is the maximum length with, which can be entered here. I have the opportunity to make the field required or not. I can also decide if there should be an upcharge charged if someone is entering text. I can enable right to left. I can also move on. We can also add a tooltip. So this is also sometimes interesting. And also I can add translations. So if I have a translation plugin on my store so that it will also work in different kind of languages. Now we can move on. We can decide if we want to show the field on all products, just on specific products, specific variants or specific collections. In my case, let's say we want to show it just on this bracelet here. So let us enter the name also, what kind of product we are looking for. Using a simple, right, this is the bracelet. So this is my product name. I can now just click the save button. Now the field is getting generated and now we can go back to the product page. I can just refresh it and what we see is the field which I have styled according to my imagination. So I can change it whatever I want to change it like. So this is what you can do. And yeah, it's ready. People can start entering their individual personalization informations and it will be also shown in the restrictive order. That's it, how simple it is.